Hi, this is Brett here at Aeromotive, uh, another Tech Tuesday installment. I want to take a minute today to talk to you briefly about Aeromotive liquid filled fuel pressure gauges. We offer gauges for both carbureted and fuel injected engines. They're available in a pressure range of 0 to 15 psi and 0 to 100 psi, and obviously 0 to 15 for carbureted, 0 to 100 for fuel injection. These gauges are constructed with a stainless steel case and a solid brass inlet. The case and the bezel are engineered to seal the silicon liquid inside the gauge case. The back of the gauge with the brass connection with a little bit of a PTFE uh, paste for sealing will screw right into most aeromotive regulators which have a gauge port already installed. They can also be installed elsewhere in the system if you have a different place you want to pressure check. The liquid filled part of this gauge uh, is important. We, we fill these gauges with a silicon liquid that is designed to cushion and protect the board and tube mechanism inside. Uh, gauges can be somewhat fragile, especially the low pressure gauges. Having the silicon liquid inside uh, when you install the gauge under the hood protects it from heat and vibration when the engine is running. But it also creates a situation which my, a lot of people have experienced but they don't always know what's going on. With a liquid filled gauge as it sits under the hood and gets hot, the oil in the case can expand and create a counter pressure in the gauge case. What that does is that actually offsets the pressure inside the board and tube and allows the reading on the gauge to be affected by the case pressure. As it builds more pressure, the reading falls. On a fuel injected engine with a pressure that drops 3 or 4 psi, it's a concern but it's not an alarm. On a carbureted engine with 7 pounds of base pressure, if your pressure regulator reads 2 or 3 after everything gets hot, that's an immediate concern. With our gauges, we have what we call our equalizer valve in the top of the gauge. It's a small brass pin in the middle of the rubber plug where they put the oil. And that pin basically is simply pulled up slightly. You do not have to remove it. It's a stepped pin, so when it gets to the point where it feels loose in the rubber plug, it automatically equalizes atmospheric pressure into the gauge, and the gauge will immediately correct and any error related to the heat and the hot oil and the expanding oil in the case is immediately corrected. Then you just push it back down and now the gauge reads correctly when it's hot. These are an awesome gauge both from the standpoint of appearance with a nice white face, red needle, they're easy to read, but with the equalizer gauge uh, feature in the top or the equalizer valve, now you don't have to worry about not knowing what your fuel pressure is when the regulator is hot or when the, when the gauge is hot. Thanks for joining us for Tech Tuesday. There is a tech bulletin on our website at aeromotiveinc.com, tech help, tech bulletins, and it's on liquid filled pressure gauges. If you need more information, you can also find the gauges on our website, www.aeromotiveinc.com. Of course, they're in stock at all of our dealers as well. Thanks for joining us and have a great day.